Yeah, we're on Saturn. So, let's go to that anus. Um... Oh, it even looks all techno-y! I didn't even notice that before. Oh, I guess that's the spirit. Like, they each have, like, a spirit. Each planet has a spirit that looks down on it. Oh, we've got, we've got cool clouds and green grasses. Uh, which basically makes this a Kirby game. Okay. I, I just spawned in the sky again. Oh, it's cows! It's cows. It's demons and cows! My two favorite things. No. <laughs> Look at this freaking like Moai head thing. Oh, you can turn it around. Okay. Oh, he's got like holes in his head. <laughs> Why did you reply to that, Parker? You heard me whispering. Shooting love lace. Look at this thing! Holy crap, look at that. That is fantastic. He's got an apple core for. Oh, I ate his legs. I'm so sorry, my friend. Parker is replying to me. Look at the houses! The houses are checkered things! Oh man. Oh man. Your anus is so peaceful. If you know what I mean. I'm sorry, the jokes were unavoidable. Oh, there's a boy effigy. I'm just gonna push this. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna I'm just gonna I'm just gonna excuse me. Wow, this is really heavy. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna yeah. It was like that when I got here. Oh, it's a, it's an angel. I'm gonna eat you, angel. Yeah, take that. This guy's having a good time. <laughs> the faces on the stumps. I'm gonna eat a heart. All right, where is my home? Just follow the rainbow, like boogers it shoots up. I don't know. I love the little different particle effects that everything has when it moves around. They're, they're different per world, too. Alright. The fun thing, a, bi a big fun thing about a new planet is just finding out what the theme is. It seems to be the checker patterns and, you know, green grasses and- ooh, hearts! Like, freaking heart lollipops! What the- or like, umbrellas? What are these? No, 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 zoom, zoom the other way. Zoom, no, zoom, zoom. Zoom, zoom. So I just reverted to Simlish there. What a peaceful planet. Look at the, look at the beast sign. There you go. Oh, and then there's the fist of Uranus. Um, what a peaceful planet. Look at this guy. He's got a freaking rainbow rotating crotch. What a wonderful planet. I hope he never stops making. I hope the Katamari creator never stops making these games. Like crazy stuff. It's been a while since the last like real like non weird Katamari cash in or remake. I don't even mind the Katamari like enhanced like remake. Thinger dangers like the PS3 one and the Vita one. They're alright, they're not really... Like, they have some nice new remixes usually. Um, but what I really don't like, like the, the mobile game is like some weird idol game or something? Like, I don't... No, the mobile one sounds... I don't, I don't approve of that one. But it's been so, so long since like... It's Watam, which is an un, un... You know, not released yet. Excuse me, Parker. There you go. Um... You know, Watam's coming in the future. I think this game is the last, like, new one. And then... Is it really just Katamari before that? No, this can't be... Did he make other things? I don't know, but... It's the... This is where the restroom sign people come from. I'm so... Oh, and chess pieces. So yeah, the restroom people. Oh, there's a penguin. Hello, penguin. Do you like the penguin, Parker? Yeah, I bet you do. Oh, and there's Triangle Man. Triangle Man, Triangle Man. I like this chess planet. Look at this! Look at this robot! What a good robot! What a good. Ah, this camera thing is so weird. Oh, hello, particles. Thank you for shearing my eyes out with your splendor. Is this another weird tornado thing? It sure is. Oh, is this music about to get awesome?
I don't think the drop is gonna happen. <laughs> the speaker! Holy shit! I never knew that! Hold up, I have to eat the speaker now. Where'd it go? Fortunately, I can echolocate it. But. Wait, this has gotta be a different speaker, right? There's no way I pooped it all the way over here. Speaker! How delightful! You can now enjoy the silence. Wait. Is there a second speaker or is that sound coming from inside me? The beat is coming from inside Uranus. Okay, let me let me eat the other side of this music. <laughs> Wonderful. Sounds oh zebra seahorse things not seahorses at all the like Trojan horse bicycles it's brilliant oh there's IGN again I, I'm I'm now completely sure that what I saw was in fact an eight not a uh, we're just gonna take the speakers with us it was a B that I saw not a score thing but whatever I'm glad it happened because I got to chase what I was imagining. Was a, uh, sometimes just imagining the fun things is is good enough. You know, it doesn't have to make sense. That's that's what kind of what this game teaches you. Sometimes, as long as you're having fun, it doesn't matter why. It's it, you know, you just you just do you. You just enjoy what's going on around you. We got some apple, apple hell going on. Not as popular as bullet hell, but you know, it's all right. <laughs> Rock paper scissors hands. We've got whatever's going on with that head. I feel like that head should be at the, like, the museum, the New York Museum of Modern Art. Hold on, I need to test a theory and see the, uh, the underside of this mushroom. Oh, there's no face under there, okay. I was wondering if there was a second face. That would be so weird if there was, like, because, like, that's part of the mushroom that has a face on the top of the stem. Imagine just being this dude, like, in a mushroom, and, like, your face is just constantly pressed up against another dude's face inside the mushroom, like... This this game sure makes me say some sentences, alright? It sure does. Alright, just a couple more, just a couple more. I just gotta have that last hit. Just, just one more hit, man, just one more. Oh, look at that rainbow tower! Oh, we have to go to the tower. Oh, is that a dolphin? Is that a crazy sea dolphin? Oh, you are. That would eat you. You're not so hot, Mr. Dolphin. People, people think you're intelligent, but you know what? You suck. You can't breathe underwater. You suck. Get out of here. Dolphins. Anyway. The tower. Yes. Yes. The heart cloud. Oh, can I stand on the heart cloud? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Batman. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Batman. Oh, I'm weighing down the cloud. I am killing this cloud. I'm sorry, cloud. Your Aries is in another castle. Alright, I'll stop killing the cloud now. I wanna go in the flight house. Oh, look at this thing. I want this. I want this in my backyard. Just this constantly rotating hell tower of rainbow. And I want all my neighbors to be like, what on earth is this? And I'll be like, it's awesome, that's what it is, Gerald! And then Gerald will just be jealous of my awesome rainbow tower, like he should be. Frickin' Gerald. See, isn't this just, isn't this, you know, if you had a rainbow frickin' tower, and you could just climb up in there, and just look out, and he'd be like, hey, screw everybody that isn't me, I have this, and you don't. You don't have this. You don't have this, Gerald. You suck. You just have your two-car garage. You don't even have two cars, Gerald. You don't. You're just pretending. You just want people to think that you have things. But you don't. You don't have a giant rainbow tower, Gerald. You don't have it. And I do. Anyway, that was nice. Sometimes you just need a nice little rainbow tower. Well, is that is that Mr. Earthman? Is that Mr... No, that's Mr... What, what are you? You have no... You don't have a face. You just... Oh. It's a little unsettling. I, what, what, what are you? I, I guess he's the Saturn man? Like, because he... He's silver. Oh, he's got freaking... 
cones for hands! I think I fought this thing in Earthbound. He's like the triangle, or the... He's like Molecule Man, or whatever that is. You know, the, the time bomb thing in, in Magicant? There's a, there's a thing in Earthbound that looks like that, trust me. Oh, what is this? What is this? What? I, I think this might be God. I think I should probably worship this thing. What is this? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gyrating under God's genitals, I'm sorry, God. Um, look at this thing! Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I should worship this thing. But I'm gonna eat it instead. Oh, I can't eat it. Oh well. There's the cat princess again. Say hi to cat princess, everyone! Oh, there's another one of these things. I love, like, vaguely sentient things made out of just geometric garbage, like the cone mans and the triangle men. Like, more games just need weird crap like that. More games need to be weird, you know. Too few games embrace their inner weirdness. And I always try my best to find the coolest and bestest, most weirdest games for all of you lovely people. And uh, I hope I've succeeded. And uh, if there's new, if there's other cool weird games that you haven't seen me play, oh, that's how you, you rotate with the right stick, the hair on the house. Anyway, if, if you see cool weird games that you think I might like, you just you just send those right my way. What is this? What is this? It's like, it's Tower Paradise. I think this is a, this is a level of from Mist. Oh no, they're like uh, Roman thingers. Some, we got some whatever the Ionic and uh, whatever columns. Oh, there's little Saturns all over the place. Or no, they're Uranai. Uranai. Saturn was the last one. This is yeah. Those in Saturn supposed to be blue. Is Uranus blue too? I don't know. I think it's just blue in this game, because like the colors in this game don't necessarily map up. I mean, Pluto is freaking rainbows, <laughs> which I'm actually really glad Pluto is rainbows, because it took us, it took us what, seven, seven years? No, seven, it wasn't seven, was it? Six, six years to, uh, to reach Pluto. So it was really nice that Pluto was kind of a special thing. And then we took this trip all the way back around back to Earth, which was, that was pretty cool. Um, and, and like I said, one, once we get to the end, I'll, I'll read I'll read the letter, and many feels will be had. But um, I don't want to start with that, because it's really emotional, and it, 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 you gotta understand the journey we took. Like, it's kind of hard to understand just from playing, or just from walking around, because, I mean, you don't really get the total sense of the feeling, but, you know, for years, actual years, um, I don't know how many people play this game, but I'm gonna say, you know, definitely thousands, tens of thousands, maybe even hundreds of thousands, I'm not sure. Yeah, that's probably the high bound. Um, but yeah, we just open this game, let's stretch out a little bit, poke around, see some cool, crazy stuff. Oh, there's a foot. I think that's, I don't think that's how you play rock, paper, scissors. And then we would, uh, we would go up here, we would uh, report our length. So yeah, I got 4,000 meters. That's pretty decent. You know, for what's effectively maybe a day's play. You know, I think the longest you can stretch out on one map, or like in one go, is 100 meters, I think. I wanna eat more. So yeah, she would, she would grow a little bit, you know, it's a little different now, but we would come here. She really does have an appetite. See, we'd go here. Oh man, that is, that is, is that Vaporwave? This is Vaporwave! Look at this Vaporwave! What a good, what a good Vaporwave. Um, let me do one more, let me just zoom out. I want to zoom out. So we see the whole planet and this Vaporwave god looking down upon us. Look at that Vaporwave booty! Oh my! I'm not sure I can show that. Um, I don't think I can really rotate the camera like that. I'm not sure how to mess with it. Oh! Oh! Hey, buddy. Hey, bit. Oh. Woo! Let's look away. That's creepy. Alright. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in the thing! Excellent. But yeah, we pretty much, we went through that whole process, you know, reporting the length. And then after a while, there was a multiplier they added that was just totally random. 
You know, some days it would be five times the length, some days it would be, you know, maybe a hundred. And, you know, but even with the multiplier, it was a really long journey to get to the, uh, to the end of the solar system. And, uh, we eventually did it. But, uh, I mean, it took, it took over a year, I'm sure, to even get this far. And Pluto, I don't remember my exact links, but Pluto was farther than, like, all the other planets combined. Um, it was, it was a real long journey, and we only really got there because of, there was a 2000 multiplier for 2015 multiplier, um, for 2015, and we, we started playing again, sort of, and, uh, we all submitted our links, and eventually we got there, and all the way back. That was pretty crazy. Yeah, we'll, we'll see a bit more of that, um, I think we got a couple more videos. Yeah, eventually I'll read the letter, and the letter, if you haven't read the letter, it, it's really sweet. I, I would actually recommend waiting, if you care. Like, if you're gonna watch the whole series, do watch the whole series, then read the letter, because it's it's pretty touching. Okay, I love that we can swoop around here. Hey, let's take a look at the... The, uh, let's take a look at the last... <laughs> this is the last place. How often do you get to see the last place? Hullabalooza. <laughs> When, oh, here we go! 150,000 people contributed to Girl's Length. And, I mean, a lot of these people probably have zero. Oh, no, they've- these- all these people contributed. Okay. See, this person only contributed one length. Like, oh right, I'm going the wrong way. Okay, this interface works really weird. Okay. Okay, okay. These people only contributed one meter. Like, that's like opening the game, spooping out your controller sticks, like, for one second, then reporting it, then never playing the game again. That's that's kind of dedicated in a way, but also extremely the opposite of dedicated. It's, it's quite the paradox. I love these little triangle men. I love these weird geometric disc men. I love them, and I wish I wish to be their surrogate father. I think the hair is supposed to rotate, but we can't see it because our hair is perfectly symmetrical. Whoa! Oh! I quit the game! Oh, that's what the bye-bye boy thing is for. Okay. Bye-bye! Well, I didn't actually mean to do that, but hey. That's a good way. I should show off all the things. Oh, look at the disc wee in the, uh, in the helicopter! Wow. What a game. Oh my god, it's the vaporwave dude! Oh man, I'm so scared. Alright. So yeah, more Nobi Nobi Boy. I guess we got two more episodes, I think. So tune in more for more weird.